Being on the spirit squad at Indiana State is like being a member of any other sports team at the university. Practice throughout the week, and when game day finally rolls around, it's time to showcase the team skills. The dance team knows anywhere from 15 to 20 at a time. Cheer team probably has somewhere around 20 skills or stunts that they know at a time, and we're constantly adding, getting rid of the old and adding new. Captain Nicholas Scott has been a member of the ISU cheer team since coming to Indiana State his freshman year. Now, a senior, he says his time with the team has been a memorable experience, and now that he's captain, it makes it even better. It's been a great experience. Uh, it's always ups and downs. It's kind of like being a manager of a business. You're going to have good days and you're going to have bad days. That's what I've most liked about being a captain. Being a captain is something typically reserved for seniors on the squad. But for one Sparkette, she has found herself with captain responsibilities in only her junior year. It's actually a really big responsibility because I've never been a captain for a dance team. So it's a big responsibility. but. I like it. Being on the spirit squad isn't just about learning different routines for the cheerleaders and dance team. It's also about learning life responsibilities and how to be a better teammate and friend. Freshman year, I was timid, shy. By my third year, I've probably grown to be more comfortable, not just in my own skin, but like around other people on the team. Freshman Olivia Dillian says she has already learned and grown so much in her brief time with the team. She says she looks forward to the opportunities being a member of the Sparkettes will provide for her both on and off the dance floor. I really look forward to growing in um, my next semester of my freshman year and my remaining time at Indiana State University. I look forward to not only improving as a dancer, but improving as a person. Spirit Squad coach Tammy Scheich says the successes and experiences of her team is what makes it all about when it comes to being a coach. She says watching them grow as people, though, that's what makes it all worth it. Their success is my success. I always tell them that I'm the promoter, I'm the manager. I'm just here to make sure that they have a great experience, that they grow in this position, and that they go out and be stellar human beings, because that's really more important than being on the Spirit Squad. Senior Luke Ryle has faced some adversity during his time with the Indiana State Spirit Squad, but he says he's grateful for his time that he spent with his teammates. It's been amazing. I came here my first year as a freshman, uh, I joined the cheer team as a cheerleader uh, late, right around homecoming. And um, then going into my sophomore year, I had a little, uh, a little bump where it set me off one semester. And then I came back second semester of my sophomore year as Sycamore Sam, and I've just rolled with it. Ryle says he's been a part of many different types of teams while being a member of the Indiana State Spirit Squad. But he says the future looks bright for both the cheer team as well as the Sparkettes. I've gone through a lot of different teams. My freshman year, the team atmosphere was awesome. And then uh, sophomore year, I, like I said, I had that bump. And then I came back, and it was good. And then my junior year, the team had a little, uh, we kind of fell apart. And then now we've got a lot of young uh, talent on the team. And so it's brought that spirit back up. The bumps in the road the cheer team faced during Ryle's junior year might have been a rough experience at the time but it also showed the team was more than just a performance crew. It showed who actually really cared. Um, we went down from a team of 15 to six, and on that team was two freshmen, two juniors, two seniors, and us six got really close, and that's what a team is, is how close, and the other ones, you know, they just didn't have that team spirit, and they didn't want to stick it out, and they weren't part of the, you know, family like we were. I never had a sister growing up, and now that I'm here at Indiana State, I have 12 sisters, and it's absolutely amazing. I can go to them for everything. We are definitely a big family. I consider them, like, my best friends. I have some of my best friends that are on the cheer team that once I graduate college, I know I'll still be best friends with them. Coach Shike agrees with her team. It's like a family. But just like a family, it can come with some growing pains. But when they all come together, it builds perfectly towards goals found common with their team. We do make a family. And so just like a family, sometimes that works well. And sometimes you have to learn how to work with members in your family. But it means we're all part of the same group. And we all want the same thing, which is success and to have a good time.